Okay. And second to last is... This one even has a box for it. It's Emerald's Kick It Up Red Pepper Sauce. Okay. Let's look at the bottle and see what we got going on here. Ooh, looks nice. Just break this box down. Off you go. Hey, here's the bottle. It says Shake Well. Okay, cayenne peppers, distilled vinegar, salt, and garlic. Cool. Peppers are the first ingredient, although based on the ingredient listing, I'm guessing it's yet another <laughs> Tabasco clone. Seems quite watery. Okay. Let me guess. Plastic thing? Ha! Tabasco-y. Just the, by the... Ooh, it sm actually smells a little more. It almost smells... Like there was some sort of booze in it. Like... Like some sort of... Um, bourbon or whiskey. Not anymore so much. Actually does have a lingering... Aroma almost... A, un undertone of just alcohol, grain alcohol. Weird. Doesn't It's not listed in the ingredients, so I guess I'll find out if it has it in it or not, just by the taste. I should be able to tell. Yeah, it's very watery, Tabasco-y like. Mm-hmm. It does. It tastes like there's alcohol in it. Funky. Not bad. It does taste like another Tabasco. Really heavy on the vinegar. A little bit salty. Not as much so. The cayenne uh, flavor was slightly different than some of the others, but um, essentially the same formula. Um, negligible on the heat. A little bit on the top of my tongue and a little bit on the top part of the back of my throat. Like my soft palate. Nothing on my lips or pretty much anywhere else in my mouth. Lingering taste of like a... It is almost like a whiskey-like flavor. For the aftertaste. Definitely while I had the sauce swishing around in my mouth, it did taste like there's alcohol in it. When I had it in my mouth, it didn't taste like the bourbon, but it smelled like it, and then... An aftertaste of almost like a maybe a maybe a whiskey or a brandy, very strange. Since it's not listed in the ingredients, I can only scratch my head. Um, but yeah, Emeralds kick it up. Red pepper sauce. Um, just another Tabasco clone with a slightly bourbony or whiskey-like brandyish flavor. So it's not too bad. It's a little bit more distinct, but. A, it's largely the same as a Tabasco-type sauce.